Hi, my name's Carl Freeman and I want to introduce you to Farm Next Door. We want to start an urban farming movement. Why do we want to do that? Because urban farming is the absolute gold standard of how you provide, produce food sustainably. Uh, you don't need petroleum, uh, you don't need herbicides, pesticides, um, you don't need tractors, um, and every, you can deliver food directly to your local community. So on the, that's the sustainability side. On the social side, uh, it's creating jobs, it's connecting people to the community, um, and you know, just that circular economy that makes sense. But let's start at the start of the story. I want to introduce you to our urban farm. So it's a beautiful day here in New Plymouth, Taranaki. Uh, and over the last two and a half years, we've proven that you can make a great living from a backyard. Uh, recently, our story um, was featured on the front page of the local paper and that from a stuff article that kind of went viral and then later that day we're on Radio New Zealand and the project and after that we've had lots of people emailing us wanting to do what we're doing. So what we want to do is create a social enterprise to help those people get started creating their own urban farm and replicating our successful systems. So uh, Basically, we've done the maths and we can run a really good social enterprise just doing training, um, providing resources um, and a small membership fee. So we've got an awesome team that's excited about this idea as well. A little bit more about me. Um, I have worked on a really big organic farms in Australia. I've also got a long history of social enterprise and, and being part of social movements. Uh, Mika has studied social enterprise and she brings a real business rigour to the whole enterprise. Um, and Dave's created an app already that helps people connect um, from local food to local customers. So it's pretty exciting to have this team excited about this idea. So what's $10,000 going to help us do? Basically, we need that impetus to get started. We need to create resources. We need to create the proper business structure, all the branding, all you, you know, all the stuff that's needed. Um, our goal is to train 10 people to get started this summer because we've had so many people contact us that that's a really realistic goal to just hit, get the, hit the road running and get going. Uh, in year two, we want to ha um, have 100 urban farms started. Um, and in year three, we want to get those other people, you know, training other people. And that's... Um, our goal of actually a thousand farms in year three. Once we have a thousand urban farms, you can imagine the, um, the amount of change we're going to be able to make. We're going to be able to network together, collectively help each other, um, create resources together, and actually, you know, change how food is um, delivered to our communities and um, connect that chi back into our community. It's pretty exciting. I hope you think it's exciting too.